Gareth uh, finished the group stage off with a 1-1 draw with Colombia. It was, it was quite a difficult game out there with the, the, the wind and the pitch. Yeah, I think uh, conditions were really hard. First half especially, was um, it was hard to even pass the ball along the ground because the wind was blowing it back. So, um, very difficult surface. Um, we start the game really well again and then we just had to manage the conditions really. And it, I think the lads are a bit disappointed because they feel that they should play better. But sometimes when conditions are like that, it, it's so hard to play the passing game we want to. Um, so they, they had to do what was necessary to win the match. And Columbia came fighting back in the second half and, and the wind sort of magically seemed to disappear when they were shooting that way. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I think um, there was a bit of anxiety because we knew a draw would be enough. And as much as you talk about being positive and getting the second goal, um, once they'd got the goal, which I'd need to see again, I've not, I've not watched it back, but um, once they get the goal, then the, the human brain works in a way that you start to, to sit off and... Uh, uh, you, we, we conceded a little bit too much territory, but look, I've got to give the lads tremendous credit. We've we wanted to give everybody two starts in this competition. We've done that. Um, we had to put a back four out with four centre backs in, which isn't ideal f for them. Um, but they did the job. They they've managed the task well, and um, I think we deserve to be in the third and fourth playoff for what we've done earlier in the week and for grinding out a result today. Yeah, of course, you mentioned that. That's the only important thing. We've, we've got another game against a good opposition in, in Portugal on Sunday. So um, it's another chance to have a day's rest tomorrow and then go again on Sunday. And what will be a good end to the tournament? Yeah, and, and I think quite conscious that it's quite hard to prepare for all of these matches. It's such a rapid turnaround. You don't really get the opportunity to work at too much. Um, it's more about recovering and, and getting uh, fresh limbs uh, available. So. Um, it, it's a good challenge for us. I watched Portugal against France last night, um, and uh, you know Portugal have got a couple of talented wide players, and uh, but they're very disciplined. They don't they don't concede much ground, and um, it'll be a closely fought game, but another good experience for us.